There has to be better ways to start a new career. But you know what they say about hitting the bottom. It really, really hurts. Mike 1 Juliet, this is Bravo 1 Charlie. Over. Mike 1 Juliet, this is Bravo 1 Charlie. Everyone's gone. I think they've been taken. I don't know what to do. Please advise, over. Is anyone there? Bravo One Charlie, this is Mike One Juliet, over. You're back. Can you help me out, over? Officially, we're denying all knowledge about your trip to Sadaristan. As far as command is concerned, you're AWOL as well as dead. But I just can't quit on my boys, over. You don't know how glad I am to hear that. Do you have a location fix on me? Over? Looks like Russia to me. Over. I think my squad's been taken prisoner. Can you send someone to help me out? Over? Negative. This is strictly extracurricular. Listen, I can see you on the satellite, and I'll try to help, but you can't contact me. Understand? Over. I got you. Over. I'm picking up radio signals from a village near your position. Some kind of military installation. I think you should look for your boys there. Out. Thank you, Miss July. Charlie, this is Mike One Juliet. Looks like the location has been vacated. I'm picking up one heat source now, but that's probably you. If they were there before, they must have moved him. Listen, 
I've managed to find out a couple of things about the area you're in. There's some kind of communications hub deeper in the valley. Get over there and see if you can find some information. Out. Charlie, this is Mike One Juliet. There's a lot of activity up at the monastery. Something's up. You'd better hurry. Out.
Hello, this is Mike One Juliet. I gotta keep this brief. From Intel, I managed to scrounge an old outline of the monastery. Not a lot of detail, but it looks like there may be a hidden entrance in the eastern wall. Take a look. Stay low. Out. See you, buddy. Now we thought you were dead for sure. What are you doing here? Uh, looking for you. So you came to rescue us. That's great, man. I mean, well, not really necessary, but thanks anyway. Yeah, you're welcome. Glad to have you back, Marlo. But we need to get out of here before the enemy regroup. Yeah, we gotta try and find this uh, Sirdar fella, cause he knows where the gold is. Have you seen him? Do you know where he is? Not really, no. But Haggard figures if we just stumble around the monastery for a while thinking happy thoughts, maybe we'll run into him. I mean, that is the plan, right, Haggard? I wouldn't have put it exactly like that, but yep, pretty much. Bravo One Charlie, this is Mike One Juliet. Are you still with me, Marlo? Any luck finding the others? Over. Oh, he's had a little bit of luck. Over. We're all here. How you doing yourself? I swear, you are from sweetvoices.com. I know it. <laughs> Coffee. Yeah, she told you, Haggard. Since you asked, I am fine, thank you. And I'm very glad to hear you're all back together. Over. We're trying to locate Sirdar. You got an idea where they might be holding him? Over. I don't know, but there's a lot of activity down by the river mouth. Maybe you should check there. Over. Okay, Mike, want you yet? Stay in touch. Over. I'll do my best. Bravo One Charlie, this is Mike One Juliet. I can't really talk right now, but I'm getting multiple hostiles very close to your position. Oh shit, out. Let's get the hell out of here and find the vehicle ASAP. Commando's at the gate. Let's roll. Go! 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 
I think this is it. We'll ditch the ride and keep a low profile. Hey, that's the same chopper that brought us down at the border. Yeah, and I have a pretty good idea who it belongs to. Look, it's the president. It seems your American friends have escaped. They won't get far. Those imperialist pigs are not my friends. You tried to escape from your debts, and they helped you. It was no escape, but an abduction. Most fine. I realize now that I will never get the gold you owe me. I will forget about your debt and take your country instead. <laughs> Absolutely. Not a problem. I will go into exile, live a quiet life. <laughs> I'm sure you will. Kill him. I will not beg for my life! Shut up already. Let's take that boat. 